My name is Christoph Fröhlich and I studied automation technology at TU Wien. I'm part of the TU Wien space team now for several years and I'm involved in the project The Hound from the very beginning on, where I'm now responsible for electronics and the flight software. The main purpose of the electronic system is to perform the staging, to ignite the upper stage, to trigger the recovery system and to locate the rocket after the landing. Additionally, it should record all sensor data for post-processing and analysis of the flight afterwards. Therefore, we developed a system consisting of a board computer, which is in a stack of auxiliary boards and with a radio module attached on top of it. The system evolved over the last years and for several hardware generations and performed successful flights up to an altitude of 6 km. For example, this year we already launched 5 rockets with this electronic systems on board. The heart of the board computer is a Cortex-M3 controller with several sensors attached to it, like a gyroscope, accelerometers, magnetometer and a pressure sensor. Additionally, it houses the GNSS module, which helps us to locate the rocket after the landing. The system can fire up to five igniter channels, which can be independently configured. We use these channels to ignite pyrotechnically charges, which are used for the staging of the rockets and for the separation mechanism. Additionally, we use one of those channels to ignite the rocket engine of the upper stage. To transmit live data from the rocket, we use a radio module which is based on the ROA standard at 433 MHz frequency band and a peak power of 1 Watt. This gives us constant downlink of important data and will transmit the landing position. As a backup, we use a self-built APRS radio module and a commercial satellite communication module at the L band. The operator at the ground station can check the status of the rocket before liftoff and all relevant data are visualized during flight by a MATLAB GUI. In addition to that, we will place five independent ground stations as data logger spread over the whole launch area to gather transmitted data in case of a connection loss of the main ground station.